Well, more from Lansing today on Michigan's elections. After House Oversight Committee hearings made headlines last week, even drawing an SNL parody today, their counterparts in the Senate heard from the state's former director of elections, who said there are actually fewer votes than there should be, not more. The Senate Oversight Committee Tuesday hearing much different testimony on Michigan elections than what's been in the headlines lately. Chris Thomas, a longtime Detroit elections advisor, offering a contrast to testimony that claimed thousands of ballots were counted twice in an area easily won by President-elect Joe Biden. Thomas saying exactly the opposite. There's basically 148 more voters than there are ballots. Fewer votes than there should be, not more. And while he doesn't know why, he knows one thing for sure. So there's no ballot stuffing of additional ballots than there are voters. Thomas said it'll be up to the Secretary of State or the city of Detroit to see why that small number went uncounted. And while he admits it is a discrepancy, it's not uncommon to see that. And he says it's a far cry from claims of fraud made last week in front of the House Oversight Committee. The poll book is completely off. Completely off. Listen to the testimony. Tens of thousands of these ballots. Tens of thousands just not there. You're not going to find it because it's not there. Thomas also disputed other suggestions of fraud during his testimony, including dubious claims of duplicate ballots. There's a lot of talk about not checking signatures at the TCF. Well, nobody checks signatures in any absent voter county board in the state. These are all checked in clerk's office. And saying in all his years of election work, he's never seen anything like the efforts of challengers at the TCF Center, where Thomas was that night, to stop the vote count as victory slipped away from the Trump campaign. None of your of the people who have testified in either your committee or the House Oversight Committee bothered to note the banging on the glass at the entrance. <clears throat> This went on for quite some time. And I mean, just banging and chanting about stop the vote. Now, that's pretty incredible to have challengers chanting about stopping the vote. And Thomas also said today he had no knowledge of any votes being gassed by Detroit residents who are deceased. While Michigan's vote has been certified, the state is still planning an audit to address any discrepancies.